Hello, this video is for a Mercruiser Alpha 1 Gen 2 Outdrive. Uh, my boat just has a V6 Mercruiser for the power unit. I don't believe it really matters what your power unit is. Uh, I'm going to be talking about the Outdrive section of this. So this is for the speedometer, how it functions down below here, and some things to look at if your speedometer is not working. I discovered mine wasn't working when I went to remove the lower half of the outdrive unit to replace my impeller components. Uh, I discovered that the little plastic coupler that connects the hose from the boat down to the lower unit was broken. There's supposed to be some little clips on there on this part, as you can see, that little curved white piece on the bottom there, that's broken. There's supposed to be another one on the other side. So I believe I broke this when I pulled it apart. Uh, I since have ordered a new piece. It should be here in a couple days. Uh, the other part was I discovered that the, the little hole on the lower unit was plugged full of dirt and mud and it wasn't allowing it to function properly. So here on the out drive, on the front edge towards the boat, right here in the front, you'll have to tilt your out drive up as high as you can. There's a rubber hose coming down there into the front part. It goes right down into the front there. That's where this piece is, is hooked to the rubber hose and then the bottom part is screwed into the lower unit. I'm gonna shove my phone up in there so you can kind of get a look at the hole. So right behind that bolt, you can see a hole there with kind of a white ring around it. That's actually the part where the uh, plastic piece is threaded in. Uh, sorry, right there. So the hole with the white ring around it, that's where the plastic piece threads in for the speedometer, right behind that bolt and nut. The end feed, or the little hole that I was talking about, is down here on your leading edge of your outdrive. It actually looks like there's a nick right there in the front. That's actually where the hole is. You can see there. So I just, that's where I took my 1 8 inch drill bit. I took this little bad boy and just put it in there by hand and just started twisting on it. I wouldn't recommend really putting a drill on there unless it's really plugged up hard and then be real careful. But I just took it with my fingers and spun it and I was able to pull a whole bunch of mud and it looked like a little bit of wood maybe. Um, and as soon as it cleared, some water poured out of there. And then I did take my air hose and I blew some air up in there and it bunch of water and air came out of the top up here where that screw hole is but I would recommend do not blow air in there if your line is hooked up you want to make sure that you disconnect that line going into the boat there or else you'll probably damage your speedometer up on the console the speedometer unit all right well I hope this video helped you um, if you'd like to see some more of these videos when I work on stuff, just give me a thumbs up, comment below. Thanks.